Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys something a little bit different. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how um, I do the qualifications for uh, my stop motion races. Um, basically, it works like this. Um, I divide the since uh, the field is even. Uh, each driver gets each driver of the of a two, will be the, all the drivers will be divided into groups of two. And since there's 26 drivers, that's 13 groups. Each group will get two cards, one higher, one lower than the other. If the car has a higher number, then that means they qualify for the top 13. That means they qualify in the top 13 spots, where each driver will then in the next round, the next drivers will then get th one new card each, and the highest number ends up and the highest number of all 13 qualifies. If there's a tie, then we have to have a push with whatever extra cards we have. So, uh, for instance, uh, I'm going to show you the superstar uh, qualifying lineup for um, the race at Butler International Speedway for the Pizza Hut 400. So, here's the list. Here's what we got. Okay, here's basically the setup. I got a bunch of spare cards right here for tiebreakers. Uh, we, here are the groups. We got uh, Robert and Blackham from, uh, from Fat... FedEx and a and w Martian and Trembley for our Pepsi and Dry Quark. Buddies at Nolan and Gre Ke Nolan Gardner and Adam Graven. Jeremy for Cotterman, Morgan Grant. Fields, Sabri. Hathaway, Taylor. Hart. Houston. Grant. Harris. Nod. DeVio. Barrett. Facey. Bonner. Stan Marchibolex. Uh, who are the Wias? And, uh, Conowich, Edzanello, and uh, Gudris, and Quinnevel. I'm getting, I'm out of breath here. Alright, first things first, we'll start with these two. Highest one, one moves on. Joker's, uh, Joker's into disqualifying. Hang on, let's put these back here. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Ace is a higher than, uh, seven. So that means... So that means uh, Robert moves on to the next round, and uh, with a little bit of uh, fast fast forwarding, we're gonna get through the qualifications. Let's get started. Bad luck to all these guys. They didn't exactly qualify in the top 13. But I did do another card test game. And this is where they all lined up. Calvin Trembley will be on the outside row of uh, row 13. Followed by Hart, DeVio, Craven, Morgan, and so on down the list. Now we can get to our top 13 setup. Alright, we have the uh, top 13 drivers drivers right here. Uh, for this row, the cards are going to be on top. For Nod, the card... The, the outside guy right here, not. The cards will be right here. And the other guys, the cards will be right down below. And uh, to make things interesting, I'm going to shuffle the deck. Not exactly a great shuffler. Remember, though, highest card gets the pull. Lowest card... Whoop. <laughs> Mix that up here. Lowest card, however, will start in 13th on the inside of Calvin Trembley for the race. Now, let's start with... Let's take a look at where everyone stands, shall we? All right, we're going to go over here. I'm kind of on the floor. All right. Oh, that's a low card. Looks like he'll be starting back. Oh, she's got one of the higher cards. He's got a low card. She's got a low card. So those two are going to have to battle it out. We got number six. That's pretty good. Ten. Darcy's up in the front. Ooh, bad for Sabre. Three. That's bad for Mitchell Nod, our last race winner. Uh, we got a ten for Taylor. Another ten for Percotterin. Ace! Nolan Gardner gets the pole. Oh, Dylan gets three. Rice gets four. Seven. Okay. So, here's what we know so far. Nolan gets the pole. And D got the second highest card, so she gets the second lane. Now, let's see. Who else did we miss? Okay. These three drivers right here got tens. Dylan and Mitchell got threes. Let's see. I believe that is everyone. No, wait. These, t let's see. Bonner and Quantaville got twos. And let's see.
let's see here. Seven was for Robert, and Darcy's the only one got four. Maddie and Andrew got six and five. So I think we're, how we're going to settle this is we're going to start with threes. No, wait, we're going to start with threes. Then we're going to go twos. Then uh, tens, just so we can figure out the order. Because ten comes before six and five, four and seven, and so forth. Okay, so... Uh, let me think here. These two go here. These two go here. Wait. Didn't? Yeah, these two battle for seconds, so... And number two, so... We'll put those two over here. And, uh, What we're gonna do is simple. We're gonna shuffle the deck. Twos are gonna go first. Highest ranker... Highest ranker... Gets close... Highest ranker doesn't get stuck... Behind... Beside Calvin. Because Calvin's a fast racer. Okay. See, five, okay. and five and six, ten, two. So, actually, you know what? I have an idea. We'll start with number ten. Ten's because they're closer. All right. Now, here we go. All right. Okay. Jeremy, Taylor, Darcy. Let's see. Jeremy got a nine. That's good. Seven, eight. So the order will go here, here, and here. So Jeremy, Darcy, Darcy, and then Taylor. Let's see. Next up. Next up, we have Bryce and Keith Robert. So those two are going to battle it out. We'll shuffle, shuffle them. Give them. Give them a new deck. Sort of. Okay. Two cards to first, one card to first. Highest card wins. Ace! Automatic qualification, regardless of what Darcy got. Okay. Now, let's see. After their number, it went Maddie and then Andrew qualifying on the qualifying. You, oh, you can't see the starting line, so I'll move it down a little bit. Ah, crud. Here. Move this back a little. There we go. Now you can see the starting lineup. Sorry about that, folks. So Nolan, so uh, Gardner, Antonillo, Fercaterin, Grant, Taylor, Robert, Hudson, Princess, Sombre. Now it's up to, now we're going to battle it out with these four. First things first, though, since Dylan and not got three, so they're going to battle it out first. Let's so hope if Dylan, if not, if not loses, he's stuck in the inside behind Andrew. Same thing for Dylan, and if he loses. Dylan, nod. Let's see what they got. It's a duel. We're going to have these two give one each other for more cards, because they both got tens. Nod. Dylan, let's see who gets it. Jack, five. Nod will take the outside. Dylan will get the inside. Now, for these two, one last battle. We're going to, let's see here. It's Quenneville versus Bonner now for the last two spots. Here we go. It's, uh, crud. No, I, can leave this stuff though. I will clean it up. Thank you. My sister's here, so if you hear her, that's my bad. Okay, give these two, hang on. Stupid notifications keep popping up. Give these guys a shuffle here. Here we go. All right. Quenneville gets three. Bonner gets a ten. And here, ladies and gentlemen, there you go. Your official starting lineup for the next race at Butler International. Nolan will be on the pole. A lot of good drivers have been pushed back out of the top qualifying spots. And then there's the rest of the field. A lot of, a lot of good drivers, such as Nick DeVio and Michael Ann Harris, didn't make the top spots. There you have it, YouTube. Uh, th this whole setup right behind me, you can see. This is currently the uh, current uh, race, track, race I'm working on. I just have to finish up the introduction. And then I can get started filming. Welcome to Butler International Speedway, a road course. And I am super stoked because 2017 season of this racing series is halfway through. We are at the Pizza Hut 400, if I can find where that logo blew off to since the door over there opened up. Now, uh, point being, tell your friends to subscribe. There's more Dylan TV episodes coming along because there's more sides to me than just making stop motion races. And uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So... Thanks, and see you guys around.
Bye.